before we can start, so here we go. We have Laurie Meyer, yeah. Yeah. Nick Braver, yeah. and Melissa Ronfold. Yeah. That's right. For the rest of you non Patreon members, first of all, shame. Second of all, you can fix that problem. That's right. Next time you're on the internet, it's the site right next to the pornography. <laughs> Go to frontpointimprov.com, click on the Patreon link at the low, low price of $5 a month. You too can become a patron of the R. Yeah! Now I know you're thinking, what is this Patreon this God Mike is telling me to sign up for? Patreon is a website where you can support creators, like some of the people you might see on stage tonight in the building you're sitting inside of right now. It gives us a lovely little steady stream of income. I call this part of the show, GIVE US YOUR MONEY! <laughs> and now that that part is done, a little bit of housekeeping rules. Please silence or put your cell phones on airplane mode or the plane will crash. I've seen it before. <laughs> Also, there will be an intermission at some point next Tuesday, right? Yeah. yeah. yeah good. When that comes, you can go hit the buy again, but if you want to you know, do anything during the show, they'll take care of you out there as well. There are bare restrooms on either side of the bar. You'll simply pick your gender and go spray them, baby. Um, and, well, I don't know how you do it. I pee in the theater. I don't have to use the restroom. Uh, Daniel, anything else you want to tell no, me? I, I feel pretty good about it too. Alright, let's get that show started. We'll see you in a minute. Uh, 
Maryland. Who Travers? Travers is a bad guy. Yeah. And you're with the, these all the gals in the back, right? Yes. Hank Yelly. Yeah. 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 One, two, three. <laughs> Literally nothing. <laughs> they don't think anything about it. Now, Jason has no personality. <laughs> nothing. I can say more about Jason. <laughs> He's a great leg. <laughs> a generous lover. <laughs> <laughs> then the invitation. Folks, uh, this is uh, an improv show, or it won't be one time later. Um, and uh, uh, what, what this means is, you know, we, we make it all up as it, as it goes along, you know what I mean? And uh, the one thing that you can do, though, at any point throughout the show, you think to yourself, those people aren't from me. You can fix that by buying the cast around them. Yeah. Twenty dollar bill, and he's gonna just free right up there. And I know what you're thinking, Matt. These are improvised. They have to be at the top of their intelligence. No, sir. If we were at the top of our intelligence. We wouldn't have become improvisers. <laughs> we saw the right on the wall and went to law school when we had the chance. <laughs> but you can fix it, seriously. Go buy that one round of drinks. Early warning. <laughs> Uh, now, before we get this started, anyone in the audience has never been to an improv show first time? Oh, no. Give a round of applause, first time. No, no one gets to be that price. You, you, it's him. <laughs> we have a bird here amongst us. Call Jason. <laughs> <laughs> no, sir, what's going to happen is occasionally I'm going to have to go for your suggestions, all right? You're going to have to shout something out. It's really just on you now because everyone else's eyes are locked on you. What is your name? Tim. Timothy, what's going to happen? <laughs> We're going to guide you through this, Timo, all right? Well, he hasn't done it before, so we all have to educate him, all right? So, Tim, on the count of three, I'm going to ask everyone, including you, the month you Okay, you can handle this, Yes. I think it's easy. All right, here we go. All right, Montreal born on the count of three. One, two, three! No! Yeah. Lovely, nicely done. And Jason, what did he say? Jason. All right, did you tell the truth? Yeah, Jason. All right, Jason, now walk over to Jason. I got Jason on my mind, because I care. <laughs> I should be up there giving you away. These traitors. They didn't even know his name. When I asked what his name was, and you have things, did they help? No. Well, I think she gave me We've met so many. <laughs> Should we start the show? Absolutely. Probably should, right? Get awkward. 
<laughs> Continue to call me Jason. I'm from Maryland, actually. You're from Maryland! Wow. Holy yeah. shit, it's Jason. <laughs> 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 He's keeping tabs on you. <laughs> Are you from Potomac? No. Nah. Uh. <laughs> That's how I know one tab. <laughs> I spent many a Thanksgiving in Potomac. So I loved it. But you were there. <laughs> <laughs> Jason was there. <laughs> 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 this is way. This is the way. Alright, fine. It's time to start a show, people. Alright? To get this show started, I need a casting toy. I need God! You go 
go ahead and use the bathroom. <laughs>
Yeah, no, I just like, uh, I like the foam, I like the bubbles. It just feels like a, uh, like a little bunch of oceans just dissolving into one another. Oh my God. <laughs> That's so beautiful. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. No, sorry, I feel like I'd spit beer right no, in your No, you're amazing. Don't worry thank about you. it. I invited you to this bar because I really, really like you. And because I'm really cheap, and, and it's all right. No, I'm cheap too. I'm glad to finally get to know you. Like, I'm broke. Like, I'm broke as yeah, shit, so yeah. I was worried yeah, yeah. when you invited me out. Like, yeah, excuse me. Oh, gotta take down the sign. Oh, 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 I'm moving again. This is the key of the town, man. <laughs> <laughs> we should we should enjoy it. We should make it a one to remember. Yeah, yeah, because they're just they're gentrifying. Yeah, you rest your up. <laughs> <laughs> they put you in a bar and they give you a beer and they raise the price and then they pretend to be liberals yeah. afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> Because they are not drunk here. Alright, they are from across the pond. That's right. 
We have joining us for tonight, all the way from Marion, England, the two blokes! <laughs> Did? <laughs> 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 
in the token world. Yeah, I'm just wondering, because I think they could have just said the ring in a parcel to Paul. <laughs> you could have saved it That's all I'm saying. They could, have, they could have sent it in a parcel. Perhaps they had an early version of like the Pony Express. Well, right? They, 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 had, they, they must have had some way of exchanging messages. They, from time and more, memorial. Is that not the word? The memorial? There must, have been, there must have been a way to transmit messages. Right? What? Look, I don't know. I'm just, I just go on chattering a bit when I'm nervous. That's all. I'm sorry. Oh, it's all right. We get a lot of lads like you, quite nervous. First timer? Yeah. First timer? All right, shall I put your mind at ease? That'd be great. That'd be brilliant. Really, yeah. There was a purpose. He was called Federal Express. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going to put plays about donating blood. Yes, but I thought I'd give you some good news to, to help you relax and cheer you up. I don't go right to showing all the needles. That would just alarm you. <laughs> I, I know, I know. But I know I can, I'm doing this, I'm, I'm saving a life. You know. That's right. Very, yeah, very likely. You could be saving a life. There yeah, are people giving their lives for freedom on a foreign show yeah. or somewhere. You could be saving their life. It's a very gallant thing to do. You should be proud of yourself, don't be afraid. If you can storm a beach, you can give a point. Every time you're on an airplane, someone will come to you and say, thank you for your service. You know, I, I always I always fancy myself by joining the Royal Marines. Yeah, I did. But I just can't be bothered to get up early. <laughs> You know, but then it's like, oh, you know, it's like half past six. Can you do that? I'm like, yeah, I'm not right now. <laughs> 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 okay, I can put you on the Make yourself comfortable right there. Okay. Now, which arm would you like me to uh, um, I'm I'm gonna, I suppose uh, the right, I suppose. Well, no, I'm leaning right. You should do the left. Do the left. Are you yeah. sure? It's a big Which part? Are you a tennis player? Are you, are you a left-handed lover? In what ways do you do <laughs> Well, right, first of all, I'm, I'm an ambidextrous lover, okay? So, <laughs> oh, well, well, thank you for your service. <laughs> Some people like to think of like soaring through the Alps. 
Other people like to think it'd be catechism spot in the tropics. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, the, last, the last question, imagine themselves, we're watching in the wall. We're watching in the wall. We're watching in the wall. I'm 
get back on track, people. All right? What I need to get this thing started is I need David Stewart to come on. Yeah. Yeah. What David Stewart is going to do is he's going to get us started on what we call an Armando. Okay, an Armando is when one of our friends tells a uh, monologue. And uh, what's very important to know about this story is that no one on stage has heard it before. Dave doesn't know what he's going to say either. And uh, you're going to see the cast that you saw earlier make up an improvised set of scenes from this. You will also see two members who you have not seen before, two of our company members. They're fantastic. Deshaun Mason. And you'll also see Brianna. Last name I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but you're going to see her. You're going to see her. So ladies and gentlemen, give it up. Oh, they, they didn't even care. <laughs> Brianna Allmar. Right now, David Stewart. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, everybody. All right, so um, sometimes I will ask for a suggestion, but tonight, in honor of Michelle, um, I have a story, and these guys don't know the story. And um, in defense of Jason, I am a Jason. Uh, I, so, obviously I like to get up, I like to do comedy, I was in New York early in my career, I had an audition, um, I literally got cast more than once as spousal abusers and pedophiles. <laughs> and, guy, the guy. and people kept seeing me as sort of dark and creepy, and you kind of get complex about that, right? So, um, and I'm, I'm going to take, take an improv class, and there's this beautiful woman. Smart, sexy, it's amazing. She's sociable, she can talk to anybody, she's like, she's everything. And I am this kind of like quiet guy. I'm, I'm attracted to comedy, I want to be here. I'm attracted to comedy? Uh, yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm down! I'm down. Like, comedy is a cruel cool mistress, I will say. <laughs> uh, and, um, and because she's so sparkly, Everybody, all the guys, you know, they're just like, oh my gosh, angry, angry, oh, hey. amazing. Oh. Um, so, um, um, I just kind of admired her from afar, and um, uh, I, um, I really, I, I, I thought there was something, something about her, but I never acted upon it. You know, I was just kind of like, I'm just going to take the class. And um, so we take the class, and at the end of the class, you do a little show, and after the show, you go out and do a party. Go to the party. And I'm with a couple of people having a conversation, and she's a them. And you know how sometimes other people they just sort of drift away, and then it's just me and her. And it was this almost like cinematic moment where we're just having this conversation, and everything is just going perfectly, like a rom com. And you're we're laughing. It's like, oh my God, we have so much in common. And it's, it's like everything you kind of hope and imagine for, and when you see that person from far, it's happening. And she seems interested in me. This is awesome. And I am saying something, and I not only did word, but maybe mid syllable. She turns and walks all the way to the other end of the room. And I, you know, not like one of those, uh huh, uh huh, I'm just going to get some more popcorn. She just, she goes. <laughs> and I'm like, and she joins another conversation. And I'm like, oh my god, what did I do? Oh no. Um, what did I say? Something awful? Smell like I'm going to dominate the competition. Did I do anything good? What's that? Act like it.
year later.
Like, just the letter G, or like, spell this. Okay. <laughs> Look, G, and I'll just fuck this up. <laughs> 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 Alright, I'll let you start this Thank side. You. Go ahead. Yeah, I'll walk outside. Okay, alright. <laughs> 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 yeah. 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 <laughs> 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 I feel like uh, when you came in, like I was cool. Uh, you would say anything and then just touch my bed. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> I just. I'm just, I got some laundry going and I'm just trying to, I got 20 minutes before my load's done, so I'm just trying to find something to do. Gene, anytime that you're in the neighborhood, you can come to this farm show. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, I'm holding something right now. <laughs> <laughs> so, bartenders gather around, gather around, shit's about to begin. Oh, yeah. um, there's going to be a lot of artists coming by. Oh, oh boy. boy. <laughs> Get the dollars for that drink. Right. 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 Does that make sense, y'all? I think so. Yeah. yeah. Hey, uh, Abigail, thank you. Abigail? <laughs> well, I'm the manager, so, you know. No, Abigail. Thank you. No. <laughs> you always give us a great family meal before we start our yeah. shift. Absolutely. And, yeah, nobody compliments you on how much effort you put into the spices. Say 
can't fire. If you cheat, there's nothing I can do. Thank you, Clyde. Thank you, Clyde. I appreciate you telling us to cheat. Well, son of Giuseppe Fratelli. Three baby steps because we have a zoom on Once. Twice. <laughs> just illuminated. You're just the only thing I see in the party. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Are your flying jet black hair? Yeah. Tears <laughs> in hazel eyes. Yeah. You're so tall. <laughs> <laughs> I do that all the time. You know, I've got to be honest with you. I, I didn't even think you saw me. I always thought... How could I not see you? I always thought comedy was your mistress. <laughs> 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 I want you to be my woman. Oh. Right. Oh. See? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry I was aggressive. <laughs> Thank you. 